This is the Farms.com Soybean Report, brought to you by Mycogen Seeds. Mycogen Seeds, driven by your success. I'm Holly Lucas. I'm a customer agronomist for Dow AgroSciences. And uh, today we're going to talk about uh, one of the important parts of my role um, as part of an agronomist is uh, we're in a plot and uh, today we're going to harvest it. Part of uh, what the calculations we need um, for a plot is to measure the length of the plot and the number of rows that we're going to harvest. Um, and then as the combine goes down, it's going to harvest all those soybeans in that row, come back and we'll weigh the volume of beans that we collect off of that row. So. We grow these plots all year long, uh, plant them in the spring, and uh, throughout the season we come out, we look at our varieties um, and how they're growing in that particular area, um, at that particular planting um, row width, planting depth, uh, planting time, any, any of those ag agronomic factors that we can come out here and look at. Um, plots are a great way to look at the different varieties in the same field sitting right beside each other um, to gather a lot of those notes throughout the growing season. But, as with any crop, um, the most important thing is yield. And so at the end of the season, um, it's always exciting, it's fun to come out here and see how the varieties are going to do and, and how they're going to yield um, based on what we've had for environmental conditions and stuff over the year or over the summer. So um, we're here. Um, this is typically what a typical soybean plot looks like uh, at harvest. Um, combine's going to come in in a little bit and we're going to do some strips, weigh them off. Um, and then once, once we get it weighed off, um, we write the, all that information is recorded on a harvest report um, and then we enter that into a database that's uh, run by Dow with all of the affiliates that Dow owns, all of the seed companies. Um, and we're able, as agronomists and salespeople, we're able to go into that database and, and pull information out of it. Um, because you don't just want to look at um, a so how a soybean variety performs in an individual plot. Because as we all know, um, next year we could plant the same varieties here and a different variety is going to be the top yielder in the plot. So what you want to do is take those plot data, put them into a database where you can do a lot of comparisons with um, multiple locations. Um, we can look at various plots that are in um, a particular sales manager's territory. We can look at them Ontario wide, we can look at them maybe North American East um, and break it down into whatever category we're looking at. The other thing that's, uh, Im that's important to do is look at, we can look at different soil types um, and break out how a variety is doing on sand versus clay um, and the loams, um, as well as, as different row widths we can pull out of there. So um, doing a plot is really important. It's important for the grower and the dealers to come out in their local area and have a look and see how varieties are doing through the season and then look at those yields. Um, and then as well as on a broader scope to look at how, how those varieties do at in, in a larger area where maybe the sales manager is or where I am, I do a whole region. Um, I do a lot of Ontario. Um, so I look at it from region wide and from whether east to west, whether there's differences. And basically it all comes down to me being able to provide you the grower or you the sales manager with recommendations for how that variety is going to do and where to position it, where it's going to do the best. Um, and if a grower calls up with a certain scenario, whether which row width they're going to use and a soil type, that we can provide the best bean to fit those conditions and get them um, the most yield that they can get. This has been the Farms.com Soybean Report, sponsored by Mycogen Seeds.